Hello, Taylor here. This morning I am going to paint an old wallet. <clears throat> Excuse me. The smoke is still thick, even though I'm hundreds of miles away from the fires. Um, so I have this old wallet. I loved this old wallet. I It started disintegrating, so I just modge podged over and used it some more. Um, I'm still not ready to let go of it, apparently. <laughs> talk about it cheap but I actually have a new wallet I'm using it but I really miss this one because it's just so handy I love how it just pops open I bought it in Minneapolis in 2009 <laughs> I actually remember Minneapolis I think it was like at a TJ Maxx or something which is really funny but anyways so I'm going to paint it with three colors will it be durable afterwards I have no idea we'll find out I'll keep you posted um so hey welcome to today's strange pour Okay, so I've decided to do a dirty pour. I put a little stir stick between the two sides to hopefully protect um, the hinge a bit. So here we go. I will mix the colors. I'm starting with the light turquoise. Make sure it's happy. I'm not adding anything. There's no water in these. It's just Floetrol and little bottle cap craft paint, which you saw in the first frame. Looks a little bit runny. Um, the Floetrol made one of the colors super runny. Let's see, let's go. A bit of dark. I usually do light to dark, but I'm going to mix it up a little bit because this is metallic. So I'm going to pour that from a pond high. So hopefully it'll go drop all the way down to the bottom. And then when I pour it, it'll eventually sink to the bottom if it has metal in it. Um, let's just go. No white in this pour. And hopefully I've got enough paint. You know me and trying to figure out paint. Even though I figure it out, I don't feel like I actually figure it out. <clears throat> I hope you're having a wonderful day today. I hope you're being a little adventurous, doing little tiny things to make life a little more exciting. I have no idea why you're here. If you want to tell me in the comments what attracted you to my silly little corner, minute little micro dot of YouTube, hey, feel free. I am super, I am really super curious why people watch my videos. And um, yeah, I'm curious. So it makes me want to be a better YouTuber. No playlist for this morning. I'm getting ready for an, a Skype interview. I've never done a Skype interview. I think I've only used Skype once and I'm not even sure I used the, um, I think I used the chat feature. I didn't even use the video feature. So I've been spending time this morning setting up a backdrop, trying to make the lighting look good, giving myself some up lighting to get rid of some of my under chin uh, features, older features. Um, can't seem to get rid of my 11. Oh no, I have a um, <laughs> so that's been kind of fun because I don't show my face on video. I prefer not to. I prefer the Wilson style of uh, interacting. Okay, talk about not paying attention during a pour and as I babble on. I'm fully caffeinated, so I don't know if that's good or bad for this interview. So, okay. Da -da -da -dum. Moment of truth. Sorry, me and my funny noises. To stir or not to stir, that is always the question. If I stir, the top gets real muddy. If I don't stir, the bottom doesn't quite do fabulous things. You know, I'll just make it a tree ring pour. So this is going to be interesting. Trying to get it evenly on both sides. Oh, uh, no, I'm going to need to... Shouldn't have stuck to the center like that, huh? You know that, I know that. I also don't want to get a bunch of paint on the interior of said wallet. And there went the hinges because I just opened that by mistake. 
Okay, now I gotta try to hope I can fill in this bottom here. It's probably the only time you're gonna see me do a backfilling, significant backfilling. So let's ooze it that way. Don't wanna lose too much of this or too much of that because I need enough paint to go in the other direction. It will be what it will be, and hopefully it'll be something interesting. You can always use, oh, I'm getting paint on the inside. Don't want to do that. Da -da -dum. Da -da -dum, da -da -dum. How shall we solve this problem? <clears throat> Bye. I'm going to have to go in there with rubbing alcohol before it all dries. Um, to minimize the painting of the inside of the wallet. Okay. And since this is an old wallet, I'm not really as freaked out about it. I'm not working. Okay, and... It's really groovy, man. Now, do I want to try to stretch out the agony effect? You are seeing me do things I don't normally do. Or do I want to do the agony effect from here? Ooh, I forgot to wet down my rag. It's all right. Well, it's not too much of a train wreck on the inside. It looks a little sloppy. I want to make sure I don't muck up the latch as well. So try to get that off of there. I think I'm just going to let it do whatever it wants to do. It would be really groovy to be able to. Well, I kind of think I should stop there. Yep, I'm, ooh, dang, shouldn't have done that. Not the first time, not the last time I will utter those words. We all get to utter those words. I hope my head is not in the way. I really apologize. Can you even see this? Wow, super sorry. Thinking too many thoughts at once. What are your strengths? Where do you see yourself in five years? What are your weaknesses? <laughs> at my age in five years if I'm still alive that's a good thing no I'm not that old <laughs> but, you know, sometimes you just want to say weird things like what is your weakness chocolate little fashion just kidding <laughs> yeah that would probably not go well but you know I would love to work for a company that actually would take that answer and be entertained by it and not offended and not all wow that wasn't very professional you know what I mean Life is so short and you spend so much time at work. It's like, why can't it just be not uptight and not toxic? Ay, 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 ay. Hmm. Fresh stick. I have no fresh sticks. Well, so what would I do differently there? I'm not sure. Maybe you have some suggestions for how I could have made that work a little bit better. Okay, so we have some pooling going on here. And if it cracks, that's fine too. Like I said, I don't even know if this is going to have any durability or... <laughs> I have no idea. If this was a good project or if this was just like, hey, let's try something groovy. <clears throat> so, yeah, I'm going to leave it that way. Thanks for dropping by. It wasn't... It was nine minutes. Sorry, it was a little bit long. Um, have a great day. Go try something new and crazy. I'm going to bring you down so you can kind of... <clears throat> see it a little bit better. Flink. Let's see if I can do this without causing a disaster. So it's kind of groovy. Focus. There we go. It's kind of groovy. Lighting's not great in here today. There's my white balance. Well, that's not balancing out. So there it goes. Um, that was my fun and interesting project. 
I hope you try something different and usual. Save something, salvage something you thought you were going to throw out. Have a great day. Take it easy.